Hello and welcome to the Flipping and Wholesaling Houses in New York show. I am Michael Pinto, where I teach you how to start flipping or wholesaling houses, or if you're already doing it, how to grow your business. I'm trying not to get into a car accident. This is going to be I have about four minutes before I have to be there, um, but I'm sending in traffic, so maybe it'll be longer. We're going to talk today about what do you do after a wholesale or flip deal closes, right? So you're getting money. Here's a few things you need to do, and this is important. First of all, you need to do an accounting of, did I make, you know, on a flip deal, sometimes it's hard to, I don't know why there's no connection on Peninsula Boulevard, I'm surrounded by houses. So after a deal closes, you need to do some sort of accounting. So really very important on a deal that you rehabbed or that you bought and wholetailed, you got to figure out um, what the accounting is. So you want to do a basic accounting. Now there are some expenses that are going to come up after, but you need to do a basic accounting. So you're getting money, you need to figure out, hey, on a fix and flip deal, sometimes you didn't make any money, right? Because you were giving money out there and now you're getting cash, but the cash is not always equal. The, you know, there's going to be payoffs and there's going to be people you paid. So it's not so simple. Um, you want to do some basic accounting and you want to always allocate some funds uh, for marketing. You want to allocate funds for uh, operations. So you want to allocate funds after. Very important that you do that. Very easy in this business to really just treat everything like a big blob of money and it's not a smart move. You want to allocate funds for the expenses that you know you're going to have. If you have an owner's pay account, you want to put money into that. You want to pay yourself first. Uh, you know, the profit first thinking I really enjoy. Um, but it's very important you do an accounting after a deal closes. I just closed the deal. I didn't get paid yet, so I'm going to get paid tomorrow. So I'm going to do it, probably most of this stuff tomorrow. But it's important that you look at how much money did I make? How much money did I anticipate I was going to make? Did it come close? And you need, you now some people look at this as bookkeeping. And I'm not a bookkeeper. I can't do this. I really need a haircut. Um, but it's important that you have a basic idea of how much money you made on a deal um, and that you allocate funds after a deal towards the expenses that, you must, that you're that you going to have. So you're going to have marketing expenses. You're going to have operational expenses. If you, have, if you have payroll expenses, you may have an owner's pay account where you want to pay yourself. It's very important that you allocate funds for that right after a deal closes. You move them to different accounts. That's the best way to do it. There, you should have a profit account. These are the things you should be doing. Um, I know a lot of people are watching have never closed a deal, but I'm telling you that when you do close a deal, you need to think about what you're going to do with the money. It's very important you think about it in advance and make sure you allocate things for the things you need. So I hope this was helpful. If you're interested for all the, in all the ways I can help you, go to howtoflipnewyork.com. If you're watching on YouTube, please uh, subscribe. If you're watching on any media channel, please give the thumbs up. The likes really help the algorithm. A lot more people are getting to see my videos. Um, please keep the comments coming. I post five times a week. It's not a, I don't always know what to say, so your questions help me by by uh, giving me topics to talk about and also by helping you by answering them. If you ask a simple question, I'll send you back an answer, quick answer. If it's a um, something I covered recently, I'll send you a link to a video. And if it's something new, I'll send you, I'll do a brand new video on it. This was a brand new question. Thank you very, very much for watching.